schedule, but uh, it could have been a night game. Yeah, I mean, we're playing against the same team, so they they, they played the um, same amount of uh, minutes as we did. Um, so it is what it is, and um, you know, I think our group uh, is going to rebound and um, come up with even better effort uh, next game, no matter uh, how close uh, the next one is. Ryan. Hey, Jordan, what's going on in the locker room between the first and second overtimes? Are you guys just kind of trying to catch your breath, trying to get your rest? What goes on in the locker room between those long, you know, game? Uh, I mean, I was getting stitches, uh, so um, I was out of it for a little bit there. But, um, yeah, um, getting some calories in you, getting some fluids, and um, just talking about uh, what we want to do out there and how we want to play. And um, I thought the boys, like I said, battled hard. Um, you know, it, it could have gone either way. I thought, uh, and then over time, I thought we had a lot of good chances as well. And, um, you know, it's, uh, um, yeah, it's, it's next game. It's next, uh, next shift, next play. And, um, we're going to go from there. Last one, Corey. Jordan, can you just speak to, to Max coming in tonight? Not really knowing you guys, not having played with you a whole bunch and, and then stepping in and playing how he did. Yeah, the kid played really well. Um, I thought he skated well, uh, made the right decisions when he when he had the puck, and um, just played steady. And that's what you wanted uh, want from him coming in. And um, yeah, he he uh, he showed some great poise and and some good skating ability. He um, he looked like a, a a really good NHL player out there. All right, thanks, Jordan. All right, thanks.